So let us study about the different types of solutions. Now what is a solution first? It has a solute and a solvent. Solute is the one which is taken in the lesser quantity and solvent is the one which is usually taken in the higher quantity. Uh, now solutions can be classified in different ways based on certain parameters. So what are parameters? Hai dekhte hai? Pehla parameter is number of components. Dusra parameter is uh, particle size of the solute and tisra parameter is the nature of the components. All right? So let's take one at a time. Okay, the first classification is on the number of components. So in a solution, if one solute and one solvent, the so total value is 2 and therefore such a solution is called as a binary solution. 2 plus 1 is 3, in that case it is called as a ternary solution. And 3 plus 1 that's 4, in that case it's called as a quaternary solution. Okay, so it can be, the example can be salt plus water, salt plus sugar plus water, Salt plus sugar plus lime plus water can be an example of a quaternary solution. Now, the second type is particle size of the solute. Agar particle size 10 raised to minus 9 se chota hai, matlab 10 raised to minus 9 meters, matlab 1 nanometer se chota hai, so it is called as a true solution. Okay, example will be salt plus water. Jab hum log salt add karte hai, Pani mein, so it is a very clear solution. We are not able to see the salt particles. Alright. If the particle size is greater than 10 raised to minus 6 meter, matlab 1 micrometer se bada, in that case it is called as a coarse solution. Or maybe a suspension at times. Sand plus water. The sand particles will be clearly seen. If the particle size is less than 10 raised to minus 6, and greater than 10 raised to minus 9, but 1 nanometer se leke 1 micrometer ke beach ka other size hai, in that case the solution is called as a colloid, alright, or a soul. We have studied about the different types of colloids in a chapter called surface chemistry or adsorption. The third type of classification is based on the nature of components. Ab nature of components mein kya ho jayega? Ki solute or solvent ka physical state kya hai? Based on that, we will have certain classifications. Alright, so first, a solid, insolid, maybe an alloy, alright, a solid in liquid, maybe salt added to water, okay, a solid in gas, okay, dust particles in air, alright, then we can have a liquid in solid, okay, the hydrated salts, Okay, then we can have liquid in liquid. All our standard solutions, ethyl alcohol plus water or anything for that matter. Okay, liquid in gas. That is moisture in the air, the humidity. Okay, gas in solid. Foam. Gas in liquid. All our aerated drinks and gas in gas. That's our air all right so these are the different types of solutions the topic here was classification of solutions based on parameters like number of components particle size of the solute and the physical nature of the components